Many people talk about all the disadvantages of the J visa, but let's not forget the positive side of the J visa. Number one, it's a well-established visa with very clear rules of how you can obtain your J1. This is a major advantage for programs. Now, you may be wondering about this recent pause in J1 interviews, but that only lasted for a little while. And it's a visa that has decades of well-established rules that are robust and will protect you in case of instability in immigration policy. Second major advantage, the J-2 visa. The J-2 will allow him or her to apply for a work permit and get a job in whatever he or she desires. This is really important in the context of rising costs of living in the United States. And number three, fellowship application. Because it's so comfortable for the programs to get a J-1 visa for their applicants, they don't want to deal with the H. So competitive fellowship programs like cardiology, gastroenterology, hemonc, some of them may not allow H visa applicants. So these are some advantages to consider. Of course, there's the big disadvantage, which is the two-year home requirement. But don't disregard the J visa as a great option for IMGs like myself and potentially you.